Hi, that's Chris here from FobMod.com. Today I'm going to show you how to install this beautiful smart fob into an Aston Martin Vantage V8207 using the ThinkDiag programming tool. Make sure before we start the tutorial that you install the ThinkDiag programming tool into the OBD body port of your car. You can find the port just beneath the steering wheel. Make sure the ignition is switched off while you install the dongle. So now let's head to the car and I'm going to show you how to do it. we're inside the car now you can see I have my phone in my hand which is running on a Google Pixel 6 Pro on Android make sure the ignition is now turned on once ignition is turned on press the icon on the top right corner to connect the dongle with your phone via Bluetooth it's now connected then next step click on all systems diagnostics Skip to the next page, skip to the next page, skip to the next page until you reach VIN decoding. Press the VIN decoding button. The app will now automatically determine the VIN number of your car. This can take actually quite a couple of seconds or even up to a minute. So just stay put until the result pops up. Important is that you use the correct app version. The app version that I'm using is V10.28, if I'm not mistaken, and the wind decoding, uh, decoding is now completed. It takes a couple of seconds to prompt your car model and make. You can see now it's a V8 Vantage Coupe. It's a manual transmission, right-hand drive from 207. And yeah, that's about it. So now let's head to the next step. All right, so you can see health reports, system section, and special functions. What you need to do is choose special functions. In the special function sections, you can see key fob learn and clear. So let's click here, confirm. Let's read first how many fobs are already programmed in your vehicle. Click on read. And as you can see, I have two fobs previously programmed. Fob number three is not programmed yet. So we're going to use bank number three out of six to program the new smart fob to this Aston Martin. Let's go back. And you need to click on write. So we're going to do this um, and please prepare the document that we provided to you, which include the fob ID and the seats code, because you will need this in the next step. Click on write. All right, so if you have a communication error, sometimes that can happen because of Bluetooth, so don't worry. We have some issues reported with iOS devices, but usually with Android, it works pretty well. So choose the free um, slot, which is in that case number three. And now we have to key in the FOB ID and the seats code. So I have this right here with me. You should be receiving the same kind of document. It's a quite a long number. Um, but you can't really do anything wrong. So I'm going to key in the FOB ID, which is in my case 001B8057. Okay, the FOB seats, it's a, quite a long number. So 07DE followed by 44B5, followed by 1E59, followed by 467A. Confirm. So once these are in, you may want to double check it with the document. So 001B8057, 07DE, 44B5, 1E59467A. E Let's confirm clicking on OK. Right, finished, OK. Remove the ignition key from the steering lock. Please test the new form. All right, we're going to test the new form. 
So we successfully completed the programming. Now let's see whether this new fob is actually programmed to the car. So what we do is we go back to special functions. We go back to key fob learn and clear. Similar what we did before, just confirm. And let's read the banks again. All right. So what we can see is FOB number three is now programmed as well, and this is exactly this FOB. Next step, let's see whether the FOB is actually working. So what I'm going to do is just press the buttons. Make sure the car doors are closed when you test the FOB. So I unlocked, you can hear the click. Now I lock, you can hear the click. Same with the touch screen. So you just swipe up, unlock, lock. So this fob is working perfectly on this car. Thanks so much for listening in. If you have any problems, just reach out to us at fobmod.com. Thanks and bye.